Hey people, it's Judith. Um, today I'm going to be continuing continuing on with my how to Tumblr series. Um, so today I'm going to show you how to edit your background of your blog. Now this is your normal. To okay, this is a great thing to start on. This is your usual Tumblr dashboard. Yep, just everything you see here. Well, you want to go on to your blog. So I have mine already opened here. This is my blog so far. So you can see I have a background that's like cameras and flowers. I have my bio. Um, if you can see over here, I actually have a playlist um, of like loads of songs that I like. Uh, ends on six nine, huh? And then I have this. Um, yin and yang, oh god, this yin and yang here thing here. That I can basically, it's like my um, scroll piece. Up here I have 260 peekaboos, which is how many people have come on to my blog. And then if you can see there my cursor, I'm going to put over the black so you can see it. It's um, a little like rock sign, which is pretty cool. And then up here I have a player, which basically when somebody automatically comes onto my blog, um, this starts playing. <laughs> And mute different songs start playing. So I have like an array of different songs that I like. And then you can also see I have a single column uh, display for mine. Let's stop that music. Okay, so I'm just going to show you how to edit these different things. Um, but today we are going to mainly uh, concentrate on backgrounds. Okay, so the website I use is uh, totallylayouts.com, so you just totallylayouts.com, enter, and this is the site that comes up. So you want to go on to Tumblr themes. Now you can generate your own, but I'm just going to go with this because it's just a lot more simple, and I actually feel like changing mine, so this will be fun. So you can see there's millions of different options, and all of your options are up here. So you can see all your different things along here. Uh, let's go in to Argyle. Argyle is like that stuff, which I just I just like Argyle. It's it's pretty. Um, you can have a look at all different themes. They have kawaii, which is really obviously cute, because well kawaii does mean cute. They have a little Breaking Bad thing. They have underpants for some reason. Um, different pieces like that that are all. Totally cute. They have Polaroids. You do another little Polaroid um, piece. But really, you can just choose whatever you want. Basically. Um, for this tutorial, I'm just going to use this background. Um, when you click into it, basically, if you saw I just clicked into it there, you can have a look on what way you want to have your stuff displayed. So you have like the three across, you have the entire page, you have the two, the one, the over to the side, the solid background. You, there's, there's just plenty of options, basically, if you can see that. I think I'm going to go with this one. I like this theme. Now you just want to um, where on earth did my HTML go? Share to unlock. Why is it um, doing that? So you just have to tweet your link. It's annoying, but it happens. And then you get this this code. Um, it's pretty long and pretty confusing and you don't need to know how to understand code. I don't. I'm actually pretty dumb. So you just want to like highlight it all and then copy it, um, which is the command C button on the Mac, uh, control C on the PC. And then you want to go into your blog, basically. And now you want to look around and up here it'll say edit, th edit theme and you click that. This will happen. And then this will happen. And you can see all here, like your usual stuff, all of that stuff. 
and then you want to go into your edit HTML. When you click this, you get a huge, huge, huge piece of um, coding. And just in case I mess up here, I, I'm just going to do what I always do before I start. And I would suggest um, if you already have something edited that you like to do the same. What I am just going to do is I'm going to go away. Sorry, that thing annoys me so much. I am going to take my entire thing. Yeah, it's a lot of coding. I'm sorry if I'm like destroying your brains right now. I'm going to copy that. I'm going to put it into a note just so I have that there. And now I'm going to go back and re get this. Go back and hide. This is kind of irritating. Ah, life. Why? Ugh, ignore this. Um, just wanna, just wanna get all of this highlighted, the entire thing, and then you just wanna hit the backspace button and delete it all, and then you just wanna paste in your new URL, uh, HTML, sorry, and then you just wanna update, and this is so far what I have. These posts are just what, like, the examples, you can ignore them. The part here is just basically what you're seeing. Yep, so, so far that looks, that looks pretty dandy to me. Let's go ahead and save that. And now I've decided I want a cursor. Tumblr cursors. I obviously don't want that. So you can scroll down here, and there's loads of different ones. There's an Antichrist, a cassette, a derp, a mini one, which I had for a while, but it got very confusing. You want to make sure it's something that isn't going to like blend your background and you're going to lose your cursor, because that's a pain in the ass. So if you have a totally black and white background, I would not suggest getting a black or white um, piece. Uh, so yeah, you can just have a look around. There's some totally sassy ones. That one says, you suck. I'm tempted to use that one. Then they have like a mouth, which I find kind of weird. They have a diamond. Since I have diamonds in my background, I'll probably end up using that. They have a have a Pikachu, Patrick Star, Peppa Pig, a lollipop. There's like loads of interesting things. There's cigarettes, a lemon. Uh, that's not a lemon, it's an orange. A uh, Hindu sign. That's Hindu, isn't it? Um, a hashtag number one, Nan Cat Butterfly, Cup of Coffee, Mustache, a Moon. Yeah, as you can see, they're a little lighter. I like that. Hashtag pyromania for life. Uh, yeah. Nutella. Glasses, etc. This is going to take a lot of editing to become something snappy. Hmm. This usually takes me a while. So I'm just going to settle on the Antichrist. So you can see here it gives you like a little preview to see what it's like. It's a bit big, I like that. And then you get here your Tumblr code, you just want to copy that in. Go to your HTML5, find where it says body. Body, I will find that now. Where, yeah, down here. So you see that bit there that says body. You want to click beside that and copy that in beside it. And you want to go update preview. And it 
possibly won't show you it immediately, but I swear if you open up your blog on a separate piece, you can actually see what's happening um, to your blog. So you can see that did work, but just when you see it here, it doesn't for some reason. I don't know why that's a problem, but it is. So you can see different things here. That's my content. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know. I didn't think I was going to do this. And now we're gonna. I'm gonna show you how to make one of those players really quick. I'm gonna be using my old player because I'm not bothered to make an entire new playlist. So I'm just going to show you, in theory, how to make one. I'll just choose this one with the butterflies on it. It's pretty. I don't know why they always have what makes you beautiful as the thing, but that's life, isn't it? Um, and then you just come down here. You just want to check. Do you want to display automatically when people come on to your blog, which is autoplay? So like, I do, yeah. Do you want them to shuffle? Sure. Uh, default volume. Uh, maximum percent? No. Just stick with 50 because you don't want to kill people when they come on. Player position. I like mine on top so when people can like see and they can change songs. So I'm just going to show you how to like put the songs in here. So open up a new tab, get yourself on YouTube. Um, yeah. This is not actually my channel. Um, you can see I have only one subscription on this channel. This is like another different channel of mine. So yeah, let's just go on to my normal channel. More than one subscription. Um, uh, so let's look up a song. Let's think of a song. Um... That's for irony's sake. Baby by Justin Bieber. <sighs> okay. Now. Where are we? I don't know. Mick. I don't know. Love ads are fab, aren't they? So you're trying to copy in your... Copy your link. Hannah, go <laughs> Oh, wow. And that is the sound of people unsubscribing. I'm kidding. I don't actually like Justin Bieber. I just liked that song at the time. So you just want to put in baby and then you want to put in your URL. And then you just want to do that with all your different songs. And you can add more and you can keep going and keep going and keep going and keep going and keep going as much as you want. You can have as many as you want. And then once you're done, you can um, click here to save and get code, which I think is pretty self-explanatory. Again, you just copy and paste. And then, uh, same thing. You just uh, slap it in here after your cursor. Everything that says after body, just put in after your last thing. It, I didn't even copy that for some reason. My brain's on a go slow, I'm sorry. There we go. Now you can see, update preview, save, and then you go on to my blog. <laughs> We're gonna refresh this so that we can see the change. And this happens. It just plays. I don't think I have volume on. Did I mute it or something? Dude, what's happening? Yeah, well, then it just plays away. It does, I don't know. Yeah, there we go. And then people can scroll and all that at the same time. <laughs> Okay. And please, for God's sake, don't actually use that song. I'm just gonna go and get my old playlist right now. So if you want... Oh, God. Stop. Let's just mute the computer. 
because I can't actually hear that and not want to kill something. So if you want to delete anything, like I'm gonna delete that there and I'm literally just taking a piece of HTML after the first script and backspacing and then I just have to get rid of the rest of it. Ah, why well, I, I just only did half of it. There we go. Now I'm just gonna uh, take my piece of my notes. This, it looks super goddamn long when you have it like this because um, it's all the URLs of all of your music videos and I have those. So, if you actually read it, it you, ca you can, um, How, how much it, it just tells you what you have to do. Okay, let's refresh. Um, you can unmute the computer because it's safe that I will have nothing that atrocious. Californication. Much better. I swear I do have good taste in music. Last thing I just want to show you. I'm going to keep that on nice and quiet in the background like that. I like it. There is lots of other things you can do, dashboard themes for your dashboard, <laughs> obviously. So um, I'm going to show you how to do that. I've never done this before, so this is interesting. This is learning experience for both of us. Let's do a pardon my French. Will we do pardon my French or will we have a look at the other ones? We'll have a look at the other ones. Go on, we'll, we'll, we'll have the bands while we're here. Um, I could look at crown themes because honey you should see me in a crown. I'm just gonna get this one. I like this. I'm gonna edit that bit out. <laughs> no, not bothered. Um, I'm just gonna show you now your, your floating objects. Cause who doesn't love little floating objects? Um, you there's loads of options. You can have flowers. Um, sweets. They do this. It'll happen now in a second. Hold on. Give it a second because if you can see it's loading up here. The computer is so slow. They flow in from the corner. And they spread out. I don't like the sweets. There's very few ones I like. I don't know why you'd want like Yermax or cans of Coke, but I always go for bubbles. I love having bubbles floating around my screen because it makes me happy. So I'm just going to take this, control copy, into my HTML. Where do I go from here? Um, go back down to where it says body, paste in, update preview, save onto your blog, refresh, now we're loading, 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 bubbles! Isn't it pretty? I like it. I mean, why flag like my dino playing? Oh god. Uh -huh. And now you can just see, you can, if by chance, your font, like your title, um, looks a bit weird, like if you can see mine, it's really pale. Um, you can, I'm pretty, like, you can change that here, you can, like, you can change, like, your font, if that makes it a little bit more visible, um, stuff like that. You can make everything black and white, which I don't know why you would want to do, but it's, it's kind of cool, because it, 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 yeah. So basically, I just showed you how to get the background, the cursor, the music player, and the floaty bubble things. If you have any questions, then please do not hesitate to ask. Um, I love you all. I hope this helped. This is not the end of my series. I will be showing you how to find interesting blogs and things like that. So please do stay tuned for that. And uh, please give me a follow. And if you give me a follow and you inbox me, then I will be sure to follow you back. So, um... Yeah.
Bye. Ooh.